Washington writers The U.S. military on Friday disclosed for the first time base B based data on UAL assault reports, showing a higher number of reports at big military installations like Naval Station Norfolk in Virginia as well as overseas hubs like South Korea. Sexual assault in the military, which is defined as anything from groping to rape, is believed to be significantly higher than the number of reports. The Pentagon said it estimates that, in 2016, less than a third of service members who experienced a UAL assault reported it. Still, that was an improvement in reporting from previous years, the Pentagon said. According to the newly released data, a collection of U.S. bases in South Korea had a combined 211 reports of UAL assault while Norfolk had 270 reports of UAL assault in the 2016 fiscal year, which began in October 2015 and ended in September 2016. That is down slightly from 291 cases at Norfolk in 2015. The Pentagon did not elaborate on the data but noted that the reports showed where a victim reported a UAL assault, not necessarily where the UAL assault occurred. Sexual assault reports from other big bases in 2016 included Fort Hood in Texas with 199 reports Naval Base in San Diego, California, with 187 reports Camp Lejeune in North Carolina with 169 reports Camp Pendleton in California with 157 reports, and Fort Bragg in North Carolina with 146 reports. The Pentagon announced earlier this year a record total of 6,172 UAL assault reports in 2016, compared with 6,082 the previous year. This was a sharp increase from 2012, when 3,604 cases were reported. The U.S. military said it believes that a biannual anonymous survey provides a more accurate estimate of the number of UAL assaults. According to the latest survey, 14,900 service members experienced some kind of UAL assault in 2016, down from 20,300 in 2014. Reporting by Phil Stewart or Standards v. Thomson Reuters Trust Principles